Hey, welcome to the show. Today we are going to be drawing a rectangle, a circle, a square, and a triangle. All right, let's go ahead and begin. First, we're going to draw a rectangle. A rectangle has four sides, and two of the sides are longer than the other one. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. Look at that. This is a rectangle. You'll notice that these sides here are longer than these sides right here. We have one, two, three, four. That is a rectangle with four sides. Now, sometimes you might see a rectangle on its side like that. This is also a rectangle. You can even put a rectangle inside a rectangle, just like that. Maybe you're making an apartment building or you're making a door. These are rectangles. Let's go ahead and draw a circle. A circle is round. I'm sure you see circles on like a, a, um, maybe a sign or, a, or the side of a wheel when you're drawing a car. That is a circle. Circles can be little and circles can be very big, just like that. And you can also draw a circle inside another circle. Maybe I'll put another circle right there. And I'll put another circle right here. So we have three circles. Maybe I'll put a little tiny one here and there. Kind of looks like a little face, doesn't it? All right, let's go ahead and take a look at a square. A square is almost like a rectangle, but it has four equal sides. So each side is the same. This is a square. It has one, two, three, four. You can make little tiny squares. I don't know why I'm whispering. And you can make a really big square just like this. That is a square. All right. A triangle. I like the word triangle because it has tri in it. Do you know another word that has tri in it? How about a tricycle? My daughter used to ride her tricycle super fast down the sidewalk. A triangle has three sides, just like a tricycle has three wheels. Triangles can be small and they can be big, just like that. These are fun shapes to draw. Now, you can take all of these shapes and you can make different things. So let's go ahead and draw a circle, just like that. And then I'm going to take a triangle. I'm going to make two triangles. Here's a triangle there and a triangle here. Now I'm going to make a half of a circle. What is this starting to look like? Yeah, a pumpkin. I'm going to put a rectangle here and maybe another rectangle here for my teeth. And maybe I'll take a little circle and put it here one there. <laughs> that looks like a pumpkin, doesn't it? I better add some grass in there. It's about time for pumpkins over here because it is the fall time. And my son, he, uh, he planted some pumpkin seeds, so I can't wait to go get the pumpkins. I think we have maybe eight pumpkins that we're going to get from his pumpkin plant. So that's kind of fun. Hey, I hope you're having a fun time out there. I hope you're enjoying drawing shapes. Today we learned about the rectangle with four sides and one side is longer than the other. We have the circle and the circles are round. We have the square and that also has four shapes, but they're all equal. And we have our triangle with three sides. Hey, thank you very much for joining our show today. I'd sure appreciate it if you take a look at all of our other videos and if you hit that subscribe button, that would really help me out. Have a great day out there and we'll talk to you later. Adios. Goodbye.